Welcome back my friends and in this video what I'm going to be going through is how you can move your Google domain to a new platform if that's what you want to do. So you probably have received your emails if you have any domain in Google that is saying that it's moving to Squarespace. So if you're leveraging ClickFunnels, one of the platforms that I love to put my domains is Cloudflare because it gives me a lot of capability. So what I'm going to be doing is showing you how you can move your domain out of Google domains directly into Cloudflare. So here I have one of my domains and it's giving you the information that is moving. So then what do you do? There's a bunch of records in here. And one of the most painful things to move on a domain is that you had to recreate all those records. But one of the things that I love about Cloudflare is that they can import all that. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to create an account on Cloudflare for this site. So when I go into Cloudflare, you can figure out how to create your account. You can click on add site. And what this will do is that it will ask you for a domain. And this is the magic right now. It's going to go and it's going to pull all the records. And in here, it gives you the price, but we scroll down and we click here free for what we need. We don't need anything else. Click continue and it's going to now read all the records and try to import them directly. So you don't have to do any additional work when you move your domain. Okay. So it read the reports. As you can see, there are some a records and some other records from the zone. So you can see them in here. And this will change with click funnels. Uh, all that we need is a www. And one thing is that we don't want to proxy this record. So what I'm going to do is that I remove the proxy. Okay. And now I click continue and I going to tell me I had to remove this servers and add the ones that is given for my account. So I'm going to click the first one. I'm going to go back to my tab and where do I put that information? You see right here on the top where it says custom name servers. You click there, paste the first one. Copy the second one. And now you click save. So what is it doing? Now it's going to move that information to Cloudflare and I'm going to click done. And there's three things that I need to do. I'm going to go here and I'm going to make sure that the rewrites for anything on domain are on HTTPS. I'm going to click save. You're going to ask me always HTTPS and this will help me. So when I put just a root domain or anything else, click yes. And then I want to enable the Brutali uh, algorithm so it can compress the data. I'm going to click save and I'm going to click finish. Now I just have to wait. This may take five minutes, it may take an hour. But because you already did all the changes after I do this step, I normally click here. I'm forcing, I'm telling them go back and check that I already did all the work. And what you're going to receive is an email that actually has welcome to Cloudflare. Your domain is now hosted on Cloudflare. So my friends, hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions, please let me know.